from ABC News, World News Sunday. Here's Sam Donaldson. Joining us now from New York is Ray Gandoff with today's sports news. Ray? Well, most of us have enough trouble pursuing one profession. Leland Hardy, a 27-year-old heavyweight, is pursuing three professions and gaining on all of them. Come on, baby. Hey. I like to say that I have a tripartite focus at this time of the things that I'm doing. I'm a stockbroker at, at Bear Stearns and Company. I'm a professional fighter competing at, at a level I'm very satisfied with. And uh, I've had a number of successes as a professional actor. The busy days of Leland Hardy begin with a run in the park. Hardy is a driven man. By 8 o'clock, he's into the subway, bound for a pressure-filled day of stockbrokering. We see a significant opportunity with this. After work, if he doesn't have an acting job, he's off to Gleason's gym in Brooklyn. He loves it all. I guess I'm on a high uh, for the uh, nine or so hours at work, and then I come in here for three or whatever. I, I'm on a high for 12 or 24 hours, and I guess I'm trying to come down while I'm sleeping and then get back up again. Hardy is very serious about his boxing. His record is five and two with one draw. And he came back from two knockdowns to put the previously undefeated Ike Padilla down and out. I feel confident that if I uh, catch anyone at the end of the, my right hand that, uh, that uh, you know, I'll be successful in discombobulating them. Hardy never uses a short word when a long word will do. He is polysyllabic in four foreign languages, including Mandarin Chinese. In the ring, Hardy is not an evasive target. He gets hit a lot. Come on, come on, don't pose. But that doesn't keep him from dishing it out. He's going to fight back, he's going to nail, he's going to take a good punch, he's going to give them, and hopefully he's going to improve and not get hit that much. Getting hit can do more than damage a pretty face. Prolonged punishment can turn a healthy young body into an empty shell. I'm not willing to pay that price. Uh, I don't think I'll be around the game that long. Uh, boxing is just like drinking. You've got to know when to say when. You've got to know when to get out of the game. Leland Hardy knows the dangers of the game, knows the limits of his raw talent. He'll quit when it's time. But a young black man who has earned two master's degrees and who balances three careers, that man is not going to quit before it's time. When the going gets tough, if I can really suck it up and give up everything I have, uh, that's certainly going to transcend just the game of boxing and enable me to, to do the best I possibly can in other areas. I think the measure of a man is uh, uh, what you can write as his epithet on his tombstone, you know? It's going to be on yours. <laughs> Hopefully, uh, just the word courage, uh, that, that'd be nice. Hardy admits that he's not ready to fight Mike Tyson yet, but he says he would like to manage the champion's portfolio. Sam? Tonight, Jack Smith will have more news later on the Weekend Report. I'm Sam Donaldson. For all of us here at ABC News, good night. From Washington, this has been World News Sunday. This has been a presentation of ABC News, where more Americans get their news than from any other source.